All right, now we're gonna start. So first we're gonna start with our traditional eye. So put a lot here. Right now I'm in San Antonio for uh, college. So I'm trying to I'm like doing requests for a bunch of students and everything like that. So I'm doing requests and stuff. Okay. Hey Mitchell. So there's our texture. That's going to be our eye. Place that down there. Our pupil. Next, what we have to do, well, first, we should really just dry this. So we're gonna dry it. Wow. So the people, there we go. Try to make it sure that, like, it's in the center. So here, next, cover everything else with white. Okay, next, for a shadow color, for the outline, we're going to go with the blue. So blue here, we're going to reveal this. So there's our eye right now. Then we're going to use our black. Alright, so we have our eye right there. Next, we're going to add the reflection. We are going to grab a... this thing. Okay, so we have our eye done. So basically, like, fill the rest of the sky with black. So here, fill with black. Oh, well, if you guys want to check out the space, like, I'm literally on the porch right now. Like, that's the door. Everything here. So, yeah, this is where I paint. Just on the porch. There's our area. Add some blue stars. Add some white stars. Okay. Now for this part, you want to shade from light to dark going down, or from dark to light going down. So here, we're going to shade with a metallic blue. Shading into that, we're going to go to a medium. Actually, I might have a darker blue somewhere. Okay, no, I actually, I think I ran out. Yeah, I ran out, never mind. So we're going to go a medium blue. Uh... Yes, all my caps break a lot. I don't know why. So here we're just shading it, shading the sky. Alright, now here we're going to add our pyramids. So we got to figure out something right now. So there's a bunch of colors. Metallic blue. Next, we're gonna go with like this mint color. Kind of like white. Regular blue. We're gonna make them a little bit bigger. Maybe a little bit top there. Some other blue. Alright. So then. Oh my god, my back hurts. Alright, we're gonna grab. Actually, we're gonna grab this. And just smear.
Just like that. That's what I'll do. Alright, so now we're making our pyramids. So basically I'm going to grab this corner. Make it like this a little bit more inside. Put it in like this. Next, fix everything up. Clean up. Just clean up. Next, we have our medium blue. So just shade, just shade it for the bottom. Change this up. Now, add some brightness at the top. We can also add like a beam of light coming up from it. Like some beams of light, so we'll take this off. Make sure you wipe this off. If a little bit of spatter shows up on here, we can always fix that. So here, there's some spatter here, but that's okay. You can just fix it up. Add some stars. Just do whatever works for your painting. Okay. Now, we're going to reveal this part. Actually, we should fix this up a bit. So we're going to fix this with some white. Let's reveal this. And then some black here. Then add a shadow. Just like that. This side. Add a shadow. Like that. And finally. I guess since we did on this side, a little bit of black there, lift this up, some shadow straight down the middle, like that, so we have a pyramid, we have an eye, and we have three pyramids here, okay, for our water, this is what we're going to do, so we're going to kind of bend this a little bit so we can use the water, Some aqua color. Here's the blue. And I'm just gonna add streaks of white. Black across. So crystal clear. And then we're just gonna just move side to side. The colors on the bottom from the original painting that I had, oh, you have to nail this down a bit, will show. So from the original painting, it will show. But that was usually just black and white. So there's our water. We also don't have to do this, we can make a grid or something, but we're not going to do that. Then, we're going to add our rocks. So our rocks will be like... We're going to be over here. 
These are brown rocks. Here. Just make some texture. Next, we'll probably add some white sand here. Alright, now I'm going to add a boat, but I know that underneath, if I scratch, it's not going to show up as white. It's going to show up as blue because of the other painting that I added. So this is all we got to do. Spray down some white beforehand. We're gonna dry it. Then, let me see, what else do I wanna add? I can also add a moon here, if we want. Get this out of here. A moon there. Go ahead and shoot star right here. Shooting star across. Finish this up. We can add a poncho. Two ponchos. Oh shoot. Now I believe if I did this right, these rocks, I should be able to show a highlight instead of these ones here. So uh, this is what I just leave with my fingers. And I know it's hit a blue. That's alright. Sometimes it doesn't happen, but it's okay. You just work with it. So there, we want to add more depth. Detail here. Some little grass. And you can sign it. Akita 2015. Here's the painting. Voila. Here is the fire. Oops. Thank you for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. I'm trying something different. I literally taped it to my mask. I don't know if this worked. If it does, I'll post it. If not, then I'll just do it again. But, uh, here's a painting. I have another YouTube channel. It's called, um... Uh, I'm pretty sure it's called Tiki Art Full. And then that will allow you to see this in sped up version. So. Yeah. Like, comment, and subscribe, people. Thank you for everyone who subscribed. It really means a lot. Thank you for the support. And we'll see you guys later.